गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई विल टॉक ऑन माई जर्नी टू अस ट्रूथ एक्चुअली आई वॉज वेरी मच इम्प्रेस्ड विद द बुक रिटर्न बाय Mahatma Gandhi my experiment with truth it was his journey but i read the book many times i liked it similarly i liked kathamrit it was written written by read a said by ram krishna paramahansa these are excellent books one can read learn really good books before that i should start how i start in my journey of life i was born in a family a primary school teacher he too was a good teacher of many things other than primary school teaching my father akhoy akhoy molli and my mother to gayatri molli she also followed my father they were reading reading always reading i find them whenever they find time they used to read read a lot their guru was uh, sami surupanand who also was very good reader and i think he spoken uh, in his akhand sangita 24 volumes i read many of his volumes not thoroughly though but i have read his other books like sangyam sanghita and uh, that really was good that was really about yoga and different type of meditation in that i try to follow that from the childhood because my father used to meditate with om so we also all our brethren and sisters all learned the same samya samya uh, samavet sadhana we should do it on thursday uh, and uh, my father used to meditate uh, every two three times in a day and later i had seen him reading gita and all also his guru's book i did try his uh, meditation different type of meditation which gave good result as well as uh, when the yoga book of nilmani das was of good help i tried the, because my stomach i had stomach ailment so i tried his yoga to cure it i was successful to some extent and uh, one more one mr pandey was our family guest always and uh, with him actually he 
uh, raised the interest in me. I read uh, Ramayana and Mahabharata just to have argument with him. I used to like that uh, in very early childhood. And then uh, father brought, used to bring a lot of books uh, from different libraries as friends. So we were reading all that, almost Bengali literature, Sharad Chandra, Ravindranath, and uh, uh, Bankim Chandra, and many more writers, Banafur, and then uh, uh, some more writers, good writers. Uh, we were reading their book uh, just like in Bengali, we say Gograshe Giltam, all the books. And also uh, Maxim Gorky, the Bengali uh, translation of Maxim Gorky books, then the uh, book of uh, Talastai and uh, Letter Saljanitsin and uh, all this formed my mind, and as well as uh, like Bonkesh Bakshi, Shabjit Ray, his father, uh, and a famous man who wrote a very good poems, Shukumar Rai. All these things formed my mind, uh, but really, uh, in the vicissitude of life, childhood was good, they were good. But in the vicissitude of life, later on, uh, they were not working nicely. So I was searching more and more. In the college days, uh, I studied uh, dust capital, like Karl Marx. And uh, that also was not sufficient. That uh, the practical application when I saw and really I didn't like it and came out of it. And actually it was in, uh, influenced by one of my friend uh, who was whose uh, home I used to visit because his father died and uh, he's Abhijit Lahiri. So his father was a communist. So maybe that was in the subconscious mind and that time communist rule was there in Bengal. And, um, I thought maybe I'll learn something. Uh, but that was not my cup of tea. And then uh, time went on and uh, I was in the job and I came across Ram Krishna Mission Khar Library. So I did study some Vedas and then later Upanishads by four volumes by Ram Krishna Mission. And uh, that also um, was not solving my problems. Uh, I used to visit time and again Ram Krishna Mission. Also sometime Pupunki in uh, Vidhan Nagar in Calcutta, Shamishar Ashram, but they are also not appealing to me that much. Uh, they are not solving the vicissitudes of life, the problems arise. And I was searching, I was searching and uh, uh, in, I think, uh, in uh, 88, uh, some people are talking about Vipassana. Then uh, same thing happened in offshore, Bombay offshore. One friend asked me to do Vipassana, but uh, uh, you know, I just uh, I used to go through Jigatpuri to Calcutta in 14 days on off. I used to search where the Vipassana center is actually. Anyway, uh, my luck was not there that time, and in the vicissitude of life, uh, my uh, concentration level was going down and uh, I was searching for a remedy then. I did uh, a Reiki uh, that also didn't help much 
and uh, later on uh, in i think uh, 99 in gujarat uh, one man uh, is a vipassana teacher mahendra mayavansi she told uh, you do vipassana i said uh, give me the book then he gave the 10 day pravachan book of uh, sn goenka ji i read it and then i told him that i do almost this thing he said it should not be almost it should be exact uh, there cannot be uh, almost so i started in doing it without own the watching of breath anapan which helped me a lot in in after i had the opportunity through when this go to a training of the passion in 2001 at igatpuri and in this 10 day course I, the total i could know this is it this is exactly it i wanted to have because i could go and see my self orally where there are flaws where there are good things all this thing came to my mind and i sincerely thought uh, i tell many people who are very you know uh, not very happy tell about it that they can resolve their matter i found this is a remedy for everything uh and then i came back uh, after some time i try to see that i my concentration are back i made on uh, uh carpentry job uh, a bookshelf special bookshelf without any nails of uh, iron nails is all brass nails are used and concealed nails so that was a good job on i could do then uh um i started uh, taking exams and found that my mind has come back quite to the normal but not exact in a uh, third course 2001 i went to rajkot then suddenly came to my mind that gandhi was shot dead and uh, if i right now uh become like gandhi i may be also shot dead so i wanted to know father father and uh, this uh, was uh, in my mind and uh, i wanted to slow down father father slow down this process uh, learn many more things many more things with vipassana yes it is exact but other knowledge other vidya are also important like buddhas there is vidya charana sampanna vidya charana sampanna means other riddhi siddhi many field you should be very buddha says that uh, one has to be bahu sruta means one has to be learned learn as many subject as possible so i started reading reading and reading and uh, i came back to uh, my science which was my favorite and the latest science technology because we are in the field of technology i started reading nanotechnology i found very interesting i continuously dig the information find and find and went into the realms of uh, quantum mechanics even and uh, beyond the nanotechnology and uh, quantum space so that uh, really gave uh, fantastic uh, idea about uh, science and uh, this uh, is happening and uh, now i am learning uh, uh, i'm still learning i'm learning ai ai now i have started which uh, i left in 19 uh, 90 uh, 
293. Uh, now again, uh, the programming part, not only technology, this is also technology, programming, that also I have started now. Uh, so this is a great journey, great journey. And I find uh, all these things are very useful. Uh, like home meditation was very useful. With that, I could score very high score in my matriculation exam. And uh, I think I could uh, get much better uh, score, uh, which is uh, uh, a village boy in uh, village school, remote local school, was not to get. But still, I believe that. But uh, Anapanshati, Anapanshati is much better than uh, Sarupananda's uh, process because he has added something to it. So something mantra is added to Anapanshati. It becomes contaminated. Anapanshati should be pure. There should not be any mantra. Any mantra any evangelization or any pranayam it should be the exact truth as it is pure normal natural breath that is the universal truth for every person everybody in this universe especially for the human being because they can do it and uh, all the human beings, respective of caste, creed, religion, can do Anapanshati. It is universal truth. So, Buddha's teaching, Buddha's Samadhi, Teno Samono Bhichati. Yes. Buddha's Samadhi, it is the best. All other Samadhi are contaminated with some form or some way. That does not give as good result as Buddha's Anapansati. And later, Vipassana. Vipassana is watching your body sensation throughout the body that gives larger picture. As it is, again, there should not be any force, anything, no karta bhav, no bhukta bhav, as it is, sensation. And you become wise. You know about yourself. By knowing about yourself, you become, you know about the whole universe, the law of the universe, the governing law of the universe. No governing laws of the universe are unlimited, but you start knowing about the physical, how you are being governed. So, that is and then the respect for law, nature, Dhamma comes. And who discovered it? The Buddha, the law of nature, respect for him comes. And respect for those who follow Buddha and spread his message, his technique, how to know the law of nature through your own experience spreads sangha that respect comes and really i feel very blessed very blessed very blessed and with this i send a good wish for all beings May all beings be happy. May all beings be happy. May all beings of this universe be happy. Bhavatu. Sāpamangalam bhavatu Sāpamangalam
सबका मंगल हो सबका मंगल हो सबका 